I want to show you teachers on how to uh, validate your the email that the TS email on the 365 email on your T pay. The 365 email, if I go to my browser here in my phone, I want to show you the easiest way of doing it using your, my, um, your smartphone. So if I go to my browser, I go to my browser here, this is my browser, I type in my browser tpay or tsctpay in this case, uh, tpay, tpay, I'll be able to see that. So it opens my tpay. Uh, you enter your TSC number, then you do those validations. That is the math that is there, like mine is 15 plus 20, I know it's 35. So if you put 35 there, you play, click on login. So if you click, you click on login, uh, in my case here, I have already updated. I have already updated, um, but still there are some things you can do here. I want to show you... Uh, that is that is my my passport so ensure you have your passport in your phone so that you upload so that is the first step if i go update my uh, update my details you click on that update my details that's the red one just click on it it's supposed to open you this side in this case you choose file if you have not done so choose file then you choose where your passport is it will appear there you click on save it will be saved then you go to the next one is your phone number. You enter your phone number um, on this place called um, code validated. You are supposed to click on get code. So it's supposed to send a code to your phone. Then you enter that code there. So from there you click validate. It is It will be validated. Then now the stress where people have stress is on the email. The email is where people have stress. What you're supposed to do, you enter your email there. You enter your email there. That is the TS email that you uh, you, you we had created some long time ago. Whereby it starts with the last name of your last name, followed by the uh, I mean your first name, followed by the last name, and then followed by two last digits of your TS number. Like man, my first name is Dennis, followed by my last name is Charles, followed by my uh, the last two digits of my TSC, It is twenty one at mualimu.tse.go.ke that is my email and all of us i know we remember the password that we had put so after doing that you're supposed to first of all before you do that you are supposed to go to your phone if i go back to my phone here let me go back to my phone i go to gmail because that is where people have problems before you validate your email you ought to have gone to your gmail then on your gmail account there are some three dots, uh, three lines at the left top. Left top, the three lines, you click on them. Then when you click on them, there is this Mwalimogeke in my case, the drop down arrow, point on it. You can see my Ogeke or my, my email accounts appearing there. So I can click on add, add account. In this case, on adding account, the account that we are going to add is Exchange and Office 365. Remember, it is Office 365. So the TSC email is Office 365. Click on Office 365. Then enter that email that you want to use. In my case, I want to use Dennis, Dennis Charles 21 at mwalimu.tsc.go.ke. Then I click Next. So if I click Next, the next step I do is to put my password, of course, which I know in my case, uh, you must be knowing. Let me Yes, that is the password. Then from there I play click next. So it will ask me to it is redirecting um it is redirecting my request. I click OK. I click OK so that you wait, yeah. It's um, supposed to ask, yeah, if you put a new password, you need to confirm, but in this case, it is just the password I know, so I go to next. Next. Uh -huh. You click just OK. Good. 
now it is set it is set because active device it's ask, asking you that activate this device admin app you click yes you activate it so after activating then you click next good now you are good to go because if i go back on the three dots i change now i'll be able to see the account that i've just added i click on it so it is now the account that is active so if you had sent that is you had said you had put uh, uh, a request for a code you will now be able to see the code here in your inbox you'll be able to see the code in your inbox which comes in the name let it open so that we see it clearly the code comes in the name the code comes yeah a lot uh, it is a lot a certain alert number like in mine is uh, this was the one that i was sent it is alert 43 at tse.go.ke if you open it you'll be able to see the code that uh, verification code tpa verification code that the tse had sent you mine was there and i used it i updated my my email account so after you update your email account you'll be able now to access your payslip but if you cannot do that you may not be able to see your payslip until you update so otherwise uh, ensure you subscribe to my channel if you have haven't uh, subscribed and um, enjoy as you do the uh, verification